Hello there, this is Bobby Rapping with Wishlist Member, and today we're going to talk about how to make a WordPress page visible only to users. So let's learn more. There are a few ways to change a page's viewability. WordPress offers options for pages and posts to be set as private or password protected. Here are the reasons you may want to set a page as private or password protected. Internal or team page, it's a forum or community, updating content, or launching a new product or service. All right, so here's a question for you. Do you have a membership site? If you do, depending on which membership site platform you're using, you'll be able to set content for just your members. If you have either a paid or free membership site on WordPress, you'll wanna protect the content for your members of that specific membership level. Now, thankfully, Wishlist Member makes this really simple. You can keep your content protected and set the access for just your membership level. All of the members in that level will have access to that content. You can protect your paid memberships. It's really important to also protect content for your free membership levels. And remember, this is a really great way to grow your email list too. So how about we go behind the scenes of Wishlist Members protection options? All right, so here we're in the back office or the dashboard of WordPress. And let's first go over the options for protecting a post or a page. So let's go to pages and we'll go here to protection and access. So depending on your WordPress theme, this may look a little different. We're going to want to look for either publish or status and visibility. So you can see this is set to private right now, and we can change that. All you need to do is click on the private button. You can have it public, viewable for everyone, or private. As it says, this will only be visible to site admins and editors. And there's more in the post below about the roles for WordPress. You can also make this password protected. And you can enter a password right here, and then people will need to actually have the password before they're able to access this content. So let's go over the ways that we can protect and set the access for your pages and for your posts with Wishlist Member. So you'll see down here, protection and access. So the protection is like an on and off switch. When it's set here, it's protected, that's on. Unprotected is off. Let's go back to protected. Now the way to set the access, so this is whichever membership level will have access to the content. Right now we have newbie. I can add another level to this page Let's add silver. Then we apply the settings. Now, both the newbie membership level and silver membership level has access to the protection and access page. Let's go over and learn about the hide and show option. All right, so we're in the dashboard of wishlist member now. So you're getting a little behind the scenes look here. All right, so we want to go over to advanced options and we're in the global defaults and head over to the protection toggle or tab. So none of these are enabled yet. This here, the only show content for each membership level is our hide and show feature. Once this is enabled, all protected content will be hidden from all non-members. Now let's go look at the other protection option. This is in content protection. We're going to click on the pages and see here's the protection and access page. Now, if this was not protected, this would say unprotected. So let's go ahead and unprotect this so you can kind of see how the content protection works. We're going to edit content protection status. We're going to mark this as unprotected. If it was already unprotected, you could click protected and update. Now you'll see this is unprotected. Let's do something else. We're going to mark this as protected again. And we're going to add access. So that's add levels to content, which gives the membership level the access to this content. We're going to go ahead and add gold. 
And that's how you protect with Wishlist Member. And that was behind the scenes of Wishlist Member's protection options. I sure hope you've enjoyed this and thank you so much for watching. For more information, go to wishlistmember.com.